do 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 Drosera might be a cockroach, I'm not quite sure. But we've been coloring the town all different colors. Not just red, but also yellow, and light blue, and dark blue. We need the pizza. There's more places to check out. There's more graffiti to color. Like that graffiti. And, um, that dude from that one show. Uh, what was it? They had a D&D episode once. It was really popular. I forget the name of it. It's too, I'm too... I'm too boomer. I don't understand it. Pizza seems like it needs a logo, though. Luckily, I had a prototype logo going on there in the title screen. You shall be yellow. Very detailed cat I just painted. Very city colors. Bikers, come on in and get your city colors. You right there. You get your city color. You get your city color. You are red forevermore. Any other screens I missed? This whole city must be colored. Oh right, yeah, your kid's still missing. I still haven't seen him. Oh, definitely the flamingo must be pink. Must be pink flamingo. Yeah, actually did know Chicory, I guess, is more operant. And you have a lost kid behind you. You want to pick him up? I know, the Chicory fan. What about burger colors? How do you like burgers colors? Eh, she's okay. Kinda. You don't want to know the troubles we've seen. Ah, she was coloring in dinners. Well, you missed your chance, then. She's probably kind of stressing out about her colors. She probably could have used a friend to talk to right now. What if... You have FOMO? Do have some sweet headphones going on. She doesn't seem like she will be in the club scene now. Oh well. Can't be friends with everybody. I saw that litter. Litter in the city! I have less litter than before because I found a place to get rid of my litter. Eh, this might be the facing property. I'm gonna erase that. Suddenly I'm worried about the facing property. Hi, Fennel. I don't have many people colors to work with here, so you're going to be red. Uh, or yellow. Or tan. Oh no, the mural! I painted over it in my hubris. He's out of inspiration juice. Oh, don't say that, Fennel. He needs it filled in. A beautiful scene! He needs his inspiration, man! He's jonesing! What can we do about his inspiration? They also had some problems with, like, uh, getting this mural to render. I think I could inspire him. I could inspire him. I could inspire him to, uh... Archaeology. There's a whole temple to explore. Just climb these billions of stairs. And, uh, there's the sun. Oh, hey, that was cool timing. But we need a bigger sun. So I'm gonna have to erase that. Just blowing up a mural, don't mind me. There we go. And we can fill that in. Ah! Ruined! My masterpiece is ruined! It's terrible now. I hate it. 
Why is it going through this? It's not supposed to be going through that. I wanted this to be red. No! My painting! Your inspiration has ruined it! This is what I get for helping people! Ah. Okay, paint can is not perfect. I will admit this. Paint can is not perfect. It's just demi-perfect, and that's good enough. You get Lazy Temple. You get the laziest temple ever built by the Mayans. And you only get Little Explosion. Pretend it's a sun. I don't even want to paint a sky for this thing now. Unless I could do... something like that. Because the paint tool is not operating for me today. Paint can. Why did you betray me? It's also a blue sun. What should I fill this in with, though? If I cut off this part, I could probably fill. Cut off this area here. There we go. That's nice. Just don't get too hasty with the paint can and you'll be fine. There you go. Inspired? Oh, crap. With garbage. Fine. Can't solve everything with archaeology either, I guess. But I think the town is colored now. I think we got every square inch of it. The city is now a proper city again. We need to do something about that rooftop party with decorations. I haven't talked to these fellows. I'll do it later. We do have the post office, but I want to talk to Clementine. She's been waiting a very long time for pizza. And, well, well, you know what? She's been waiting a very long time for Burger, who used to be called Pizza. And we get Italian dinners music. Not Italian dinner. Dinners. Uh, yeah, we had a friendship fight. The city can't fix that. I don't even know if pizza could fix that. They call it Slice here, because again, they'd be sued. By, bur by pizza. Burger is going to sue in pizza stead. I think he would win. Please don't beat up people. It's not right. Also, I had, like, a guy just come out to me on the street. It's kind of weird, but that's how city is sometimes. Ah, You're just saying that because you're her sister. Ah, Clementine's good sister. Oh, definitely. We need to have a slice after all this. Slice is the only thing that can sustain us. Burger, you left all your crust. That's okay, I know somebody that can clean that up. This place needs more... This place needs more Eglana stars. And explosions. I still haven't fixed that Eglana thing yet. I recorded this right after the last video. Because I just like this game so much, I want to do it a lot. Yeah, Drosera! Oh yeah, the art. We're kind of working on the art. There's lost kids everywhere. There's some kind of weird epidemic. We got wielder problems. You're a total yes-man! 
Uh, yes, dog. You should be a no, dog. Everybody's looking up to us. They need the color. They need mountains on their walls. I just idly drew a mountain for no good reason. You know what? This could be a good solution to a lot of wielders' problems, except for maybe Blackberry. Blackberry's got problems, and no one can solve them. Yes, what of it? Do we get a discount? Yeah, pretty good. Uh, do you see what we mean? This happens a lot, Clementine. Yeah, pretty much. You know how to... Uh, uh, I was about to say, you know how to draw, but yeah, she's in the Art Academy. She knows draw. Yeah, let's do this. Teamwork. Making the dream work. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. This looks like hieroglyphics. I'm kind of disappointed because uh, I thought she would give me the same picture as before. Because I had a perfect idea for it. Luckily, I kept my old save. So I'll show you that right after I write this logo. And yes, I know, I did not show you the hairstyles yet. I'm sorry. Uh, we need pizza. This kind of passes as pizza toppings. I could put the pizza slice, like, right here. It's thicker on the outside, like in the middle, than it is on the ends. If you're doing your pizza right. There we go. Um, we need pizza color. Of course, it gives us everything but pizza color. We could do... that. This would be a big old slice of pizza. And these could be toppings. And there could be oregano on it somewhere. But first we need the cheese. We need that cheese. And a terrible Eglana star in the corner. Don't stay. Why is that there? That doesn't have to do anything with pizza. And then the, this, this, this will be... Big Sis, what are you drawing? Oh, nothing. See, they could barely see it. We need... Uh, that could be... What even is that? It looks like Paint Can does not obey these lines, so that's a problem. That could be... That. I, I don't know. Just sometimes you have I don't know on your pizza. And that could be pepperoni, but it's like a purple pepperoni. That could just be there. Let's get that oregano on there. Just all over the pizza. Plenty of oregano. No one's gonna like it. I don't even know what this is. I think that bottle cap landed on the pizza. Next to the infinity symbol. Because it's infinite pizza. There's infinite pizza at this shop. All you can eat. I am changing the business model right now. And you know what else is happening with this pizza? It's... It's exploding. It's just exploding with flavor. Perfect. I knew you would love it. Because everybody loves everything I make because they're sucking up to me. The perfect logo. Ah, Clementine. You know, people could hold this brush besides me. We had Pickle hold it. Chicory, like, re-wielded it for a little while. 
Honestly, I, I don't think there's a user limit on this brush. You could totally help out. Bigly, he kind of interrupted our conversation. Any minute now. Surely our awesome logo. See? Look at our awesome logo. It's already got the customers coming. I saw you before, but I didn't talk to you. He's named after a sugar replacement. What's wrong with that? It's got customers. Advertising works, apparently. That's what I've heard, anyway. Ah, such sellouts. I know. Gotta have that pizza, though. Also, Brussels sprout is back. Let me guess, can't live without pizza, either. Without slice. Everyone needs to slice. It needs to be bright. There we go. Like a holy. Ah, hey, macaroon! He has his slices both ways. And Turnip is here. Like, one slice would feed your whole family, Turnip. Well, you're working on it. That's the important thing. Just follow the pizza logo. Here's the old one. She drew what looked like a dab, so I went with it. Yeah, it's kind of like what we do to the food. If we only had, like, a name for the food, that won't get us, like, sued by somebody. Let's not ask too many questions about that. I mean, was this... This is like the only slice shop in Picnic. Were you really in danger of, like, running out of business? Seriously? Because I think you got plenty. Now we do have another problem here. Post office is irresponsible and uncolored. And that can't do. Let me guess, another problem I gotta solve. I don't want to talk about the mail. I want to talk about how red your desk needs to be. That's how much I want to talk about color. Do you even understand color? No, you're a mailman. The only color you know is brown and maybe some like light, like a blue. What do even post office workers wear? I forget their color. I'm just going to make up a color. You wear red now. Wow, your shirt is like... Brush proof. How, how'd you do that? I'm not even sure if this guy's supposed to be a pig or some kind of dog. Why do I have to do it? I do the color thing! You know what? I didn't vote for me. We didn't wipe the color! Jeez, Blackberry would get along with this guy. Well, I guess we also deliver mail. That's another thing that we have to do as wielder. Clementine, I need help. Do you know mailing? Artichoke, you're a loser. I'm just saying the truth. Okay. So, uh, Pepper, uh, I'm looking for, like, a house to do things. Oh, wait, it's for you? Uh, there you go, I forgot the color, right? Oh! Congratulations, we solved your problem! Inadvertently! By saving lost children! Adventurous little tyke, I admit. At least you solve problems with the mail. Good. How about we don't do that and we go somewhere else before he, like, makes us do things again. But first, let's call Mom. Tell her about our big city adventures. Clementine was here. Also, your shirt is green now. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, that. Not entirely. It's chicory related. So does uh, Dad have a spoiler for this? I've been thinking about this for a while because they're the only ones that aren't named food. I would think Mom would be named uh, Meringue and Dad would be Walnut because he's a little crazy. Also, she's speaking at a hurt. You should never take somebody seriously like that. The things they say when they're not hurt is more important. Thanks for the advice, but does Dad have any? Does he have any cheats for friendship? Oh yeah, what are we doing next? The Grub Caverns. The Insect Queen. Yay, we can jump! Thanks for jump. Oh, here he comes. He heard spoilers being mentioned. Uh, you know what? Put Walnut on. And now you're tan. Because this needs to make sense a little bit. Okay, I know how to do that. No, that's what we're calling now, so you don't spoil everything. I guess the bugs don't have internet, though. Alright. There's gonna be tiny holes where we need to go. Okay, this is track detector guy. And this is place we can't go to, so there's nothing up this way. Not for now, anyway. You know what? I see a passageway. Right here, through the trees. I'm sure this leads somewhere. Aha! My avian eyes have detected a secret. It's another way into the grub caverns, and it has present. I bet there's gonna be some ink eating bugs in here. There's gotta be ink eating bugs in here. We got Spike! We're not that tough. Even though it would show off our hairstyle. You know what? Let's do that. Um, something... Something on the head. It would show off our hairstyle. Glasses? Bandana? Nothing? We could be cool. We could be hip. We could be so cool. Look how cool we are. We're going to be showing the bugs how cool we are. Also, we never met P Pistachio before. Oh, hey, he's a turtle named Pistachio. Dana Carvey might have words about that. At least he's turtly enough to get into the turtle club. Okay. I'm too cool for your tips. Oh, right, yeah. That, you could do that with decorations as well. People will hang out if you put decorations out in the world. You know, if you put out free furniture, maybe somebody will show up. Life hack. Let's make it through the gar grub caverns and then we could call it a day. Because the city is a big place filled with big city things that keep big cities busy. That's why they're busy all the time. I see that. Messy. How do I get rid of the messy? This is how I get rid of the messy. Diagonal jump. Harder than it seems, even with the E button. There's no safety nets here. You're going to have to learn to jump. Oh, I see more of it. You saw it. These bugs do not respect nature. 
Or maybe just teenagers come in here and party. And then they get scared away by all the bugs. And color eating bugs as usual, but I saw a present over here. Let me in. There we go. My present. You can't eat it. Why is why do we wear bell? Let's not wear bell. Ah, good. The stairs to go down. My favorite part of the game is the stairs to go down. But how about the present over here? I know this present. It's off the beaten track. I don't see any present. Where is it? I rec Oh, it's litter. That's the present. Messy is the present. The future is clean, because we cleaned up the messy in the present. See here? There's my present I require. Gotta kinda jump off. The game kinda glitched out there. Trying to process me jumping into nothing. Studs! I kinda like the look we got going on right now. Very hip. Very un. Now we got water, we can't color. What a nice cave we got here. What a nice area we just found. Doesn't look like insects live here. Too clean and neat. Bugs like to squirt things all over the place. Oh, looks like we can't go anywhere in this direction. We need to explode that. Oh, Brecky is over there! How the heck am I gonna get the Brecky and learn how to color science, like the color scientist and the Amagus? Looks like we're gonna have to come back here a little bit later, but I see a last kid. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I saw him jump. Aha! Gotcha. Lots and lots of cats. Also this! I know the pattern for this, but it requires... a side quest involving the Art Academy. So we'll be coming back to this. Tea Time Meadows is not where we're supposed to be, but at least we have it on our map now. There's a few... there's areas out in the ocean yet. There's some areas by Supper Woods. Brecky's off in this direction. We need to go on an underground adventure. At least we know how to get to Tea Time Meadows if we need to. Probably other shortcuts. It's a big area. That's the problem, is trying to jump down into one of those gaps. Not as easy as it looks. The good thing about jump is you can jump even when there's no color there. It's a colorless jump. Bugs only. I don't believe in your signs. I'm too cool for that. I can't get out of here. It's like only bugs could exit from this point. Because they could climb straight up and collect that litter. Because bugs are messy. Welcome to Grub Deep. We got new colors. Uh, uh, don't step on the ants! You're not supposed to go that way! Don't step on the ants! Mother 3 calls! You've been just waiting here in the dark, waiting for me to light it up. You're bold. Well, I can imagine, considering she's queen of the bugs. Yeah, like a color. What, you're not even gonna guide us? Not like I could see, anyway. That well, looks like we're gonna have to start solving puzzles. So that will be next time on Chicory. We gotta go find some bugs! They have problems! 
These are very bug-like colors, now that I think about it. Good night, folks. <laughs>